Hello there everybody, I'm Xir back with another LEGO review. Right now I have a battle pack in front of me. This is the LEGO Star Wars Elite Praetorian Guard Battle Pack. Set number 75225. It has 109 pieces and retails for $15 in the US in the year of 2019, which is when I'm recording this video. This is one of the greatest battle packs I have ever seen or owned. And actually I think that this is, this is the greatest battle pack I've ever seen. I love this battle pack. Like, the figures are so amazing. Like, sure, the build, I'll admit, is kind of a throwaway thing, but these figures, yeah, but uh, let's just take a look at the build, so then we can get into the good stuff, but yeah, uh, this build is kind of, it's a geometric figure, kind of like Snoke's throne room was, and so basically you have these two things that spin, you can put one pre elite Praetorian guard on each, and then, you know, kind of have them battle. Lego's like, been doing that a lot recently. Removing those, though. Sorry about the line, by the way. I just moved, so it is a, f kind of a temporary studio. But back there, you get a battle droid on one of those clear pieces. He has a lightsaber and a gun. Maybe he can, you can use that to kind of fight with him or train with him. A training droid, not battle droid, sorry. But And then there, you have one extra weapon for maybe another elite Praetorian guard. If you don't want that much repetition between the few of them but yeah that's basically it for this build again it's small battle packs are for the figures i decided to take a look at all three praetorian guards together just because they're very similar the legs are all the same the torsos are all the same the neck attachment is the same and they all have red heads the only difference is in the helmet which oh my god these helmets are fantastic just look at all that molding and the detailing in that oh my god they they nailed these praetorian guards anyway uh there are their weapons they just change a little bit and uh there's one additional weapon in case you wanted to change these out and battle blacks have four figures so you might be wondering hey where's the fourth elite praetorian guard well there isn't a stormtrooper lego included a first order stormtrooper that's so dumb. I could easily see someone wanting two of these battle packs, which I did get two, be, but I'll explain that later. But, like, if people don't want Snoke's Throne Room because it's an overpriced set, they should be able to get two battle packs and have all the Praetorian Guards. That would be cool. But nope, they had to throw in one of these. And Angry Clone to make things better. But, yeah, that is a disappointment. But the reason I got two is now I have six Praetorian Guards, and then when I get Snoke's Throne Room, because I do plan to get it, I'll have eight, hopefully, so that is the my reasoning for that. But yeah, because of that, I'm not that annoyed, but if I wasn't planning to get Snoke's Throne Room, I'd be so annoyed right now, but yeah. Uh, the First Order Stormtrooper looks good as always, you know, I think they pretty much nailed this. Angry Clone needs to change it, though. But uh, again, these Return Guard figures are just so detailed. You can see that how smooth the transition is from their legs to their hips, and then this little shoulder piece, and then that awesome head print. Also, all their back torso prints are the same, as seen right here. And then, that is the head underneath. And, yeah, so, that was a really short review, but let's take a look at the packaging. Again, that was a really short review, but, oh my god, I love the box art for 2019. Like, they completely nailed it with both the 20th anniversary sets and these regular Star Wars sets. Like, look at Darth Vader in the corner, and then that awesome kind of white brick slash plate slash brick build right there, like, that just looks great. So overall, I have to recommend this. Like, this is great three, yep, three, not four, but three elite Praetorian guards in one set. Come on, you can't go wrong with that. That is amazing. Sure, I would have loved four, but again, it doesn't annoy me that much because I'm getting Snoke's Throne Room, but if a lot, of, uh, if you guys aren't planning on getting Snoke's Throne Room, which a lot of people aren't, I can see how it could bother you a lot, and I wish LEGO did include four, but yeah. That's it for this video. Hope you liked this video, and if you did, please subscribe, leave a comment down below, and I'll talk to you again soon. Also, stay tuned because I'm going to do a com combination video where I combine two of these and Snoke's Throne Room. So I'll have all eight Elite Preacher and Guards, two First Order Stormtroopers, Snoke, Rey, and Kylo Ren, hopefully. But yeah, that's it for this video. Bye.